This is the G7 Ballistic Rangefinder, and I'm going to tell you about the targeting mode options and show you how to adjust those on the display. Now, a targeting mode essentially allows us to, to use the data that the rangefinder is collecting and process it in a way that helps us extract the best range for the target conditions we're experiencing. Let's say a good example. We're up in the mountains. We've got, uh, we're hunting elk in a, in a burnt timber area. And if I just shoot the, the rangefinder in a standard ranging mode, it will probably return off of the trees that are in front of that animal. So if, if I want to reach past those trees and ignore the trees that are in the way and reach all the way to the back, to the farthest target, to that elk on the mountainside, I'm going to change the display to the farthest target mode. Now, another situation might be antelope out on the prairie. And I've got an antelope up on a hill, and I've got some, some uh, terrain that's behind him, maybe one or 200 yards, maybe 500 yards behind him. I don't want to return that farther distance. I want just that antelope. I'm going to maybe set that on the nearest mode and make sure I ignore everything that's behind it. We have also have a strongest mode and a continuous mode. So to access those items, I wake the device up by pressing the fire button. In the top left-hand corner, you can see a display for C, that's continuous, N for nearest, F for farthest, and then blank means the strongest target. Whatever is the strongest target that's the most reflective in that laser beam is going to return that number. To change that number with the device awake, all I do is press the mode button once. Short press, short press, short press. So let's leave it on the farthest mode, and I'm ready to take a range and get a solution.